Hello friends, welcome to To The Point. In this session, we'll be discussing about allelopathy. What does this actually mean? Allelopathy means it is a biochemical phenomena where the one organism will affect the other organism's germination, growth, survival and reproduction using biochemicals. The impact of allelopathy, it may be either positive or negative. Allelopathy, it is a branch of chemical ecology. Chemical interference is used as a tool of competition. Chemical interferences, it can be observed and studied in plant-plant interaction, plant microbes interaction and plant animal interactions. Allelochemicals, they are found in flowers, stem and leaves of a plant. So and these are benefited in agriculture for weed management, mulching, intercropping and crop rotation etc. Origin of allelopathy, the term allelopathy, it is derived from the Greek word called allelo and pathy which means mutual harm or suffering. The term allelopathy, it was first used by Austrian professor Hans Mollisch. He published the term allelopathy in his book called The Effect of Plants on Each Other, Allelopathy. Hans Mollisch used the term allelopathy to describe the biochemical interaction by means of which a plant inhabits the growth of neighboring plants. Let's discuss about the pros and cons of allelopathy. First, let's discuss about the benefits. Allelopathy, it can be used for producing allelochemicals as a natural herbicides or pesticides. Allelopathy, it is a weed and it does not allow another weed to survive. Effective application of using allelopathy is it can decrease the usage of insecticides, pesticides and herbicides. Allelopathy it can also be used in intercropping and crop rotation. The disadvantage of allelopathy is allelopathy itself is a weed and hence it is undesirable. It grows uncontrollably and it does not allow healthy organisms to grow around it. It competes for resources and sometimes it may turn out to be an invasive species. Why this issue of allelopathy needs attention? So in the year 2014, Himachal Pradesh Forest Department, it has pointed out that deadly weed called lantana, it, which is also called as pool lakri in a regional language, has affected the mountain biodiversity in more than 1800 square kilometer of the forest lands in Himachal Pradesh. This weed is a flowering plant which is an exotic shrub and it is found abundantly in the state and it is threatening the majority of native plant species. The species called lantana, it was introduced in India in the year 1809 in the Indian Botanic Garden, Kolkata as an ornamental plant due to its beautiful aromatic flowers and prolific seed production and easy dispersal it helped in escaping cultivation and becoming a pest with serious dimensions. At present, lantana is all over Himachal Pradesh and its flowers almost throughout the year. This weed is poisoning and it creates a serious threat to the plantation forestry and it becomes a dominant species, reducing the nutrients of all other species plants. In the deciduous forest, lantana is considered as a potential fire hazard since it is combustible even when it is green. Himachal Pradesh struggles with the forest fire every summer and it suffers a huge loss. This weed is also dangerous in national parks and sanctuaries. The government has faced failure in uprooting this issue and it has now entered the fields and orchids of the farmers where the marginal farmers are forced to quit agriculture due to this problem. Apart from this, allelopathy it is a novel application to improve the crop yield, to meet the demands of an ever-increasing population. However, 
Due to inadequate research data, it had resulted in an ineffective implementation. It can provide agricultural sustainability, environmental protection, food security, resource conservation and economic viability. See you in the next session with some other interesting topic. Thank you. Thank you.